two of the most important characteristics of light are colour and brightness. Now, people often think that watts refers to how bright a light is. It doesn't. It refers to how much energy a light uses. The amount of light a glow produces is described in lumens. It's often referred to on the packaging. So if you're after more light in the room, more lumens is the way to go. Most people prefer some rooms in their house to be brighter than others. The laundry, for example, can be much better with lots of light so you can see what you're doing. So a light with more lumens works well. While bedrooms can be cosier with dimmer light, so less lumens are more appropriate here. Another characteristic that's important to consider is the colour temperature or appearance of light. Colour can be really influential in lighting design and significantly change the ambience or feel of a room. The colour of light is described in a couple of ways. A precise number or colour temperature using Kelvin or descriptive terms such as cool daylight at 6,500 Kelvin or warm white at 3,000 Kelvin. Just like the amount or brightness of light, different rooms can suit different coloured temperatures. Warm white light is considered good for relaxing, where cool white can be much better for concentrating. If you're replacing a light in a series of down lights or tracked lighting, it's good to know what colour the rest of the lights are, so the colour of the new light globe fits in with the rest. So, the characteristics of light are important to consider with new lights. The amount of light emitted, or lumens, and the colour temperature. Now remember, it's all pretty subjective. There are no precise specifications. What might not work for someone else could be just what lights up your world.